Hello everyone, my name is Shannon Singleton, aka The Herpes Goddess, and yes, half of me is a big flex. I am the founder of Herpes Can Never Grow, and the largest herpes awareness platform, because I inspire people to love themselves more. The mission at Herpes Can Never is to be at war with the stigma until our community feels comfortable being open about their status and proud of their sexuality. Welcome. I wanted to talk about talk today about um, the feeling of being oppressed. A lot of men and women within the herpes community have a tendency of feeling like they're a risk. And I want to come on here and remind you all that you are not a risk to be taken. Even if you're in a relationship, a common concern is, what if I pass it on to my partner? How can I not pass it on to my partner? I don't want my partner to do things with me because I'm afraid of passing on the virus. One, to me, that means you haven't fully accepted your status. Two, also, you are projecting. You are afraid that your partner is going to have the same experience that you had when you found out you had herpes, and that's not necessarily true. If you are honest and you disclose, your partner has an understanding that whether your chances are above 98 or fall below 1%, there's always going to be a chance that you can pass on the virus and that your partner is making a choice by being with you. They're not going to have the same experience as you. You can't even fathom their experience because they have a choice. So you cannot feel like they're going to feel the same way you did when you found out you had her. Okay. We still here? I kind of lost connection for a second. Okay. And we're back. Anyway, another thing I wanted to ask was, what risks is someone taking by being with you? What is herpes? Most people with herpes are asymptomatic, meaning they have no symptoms. There's only a small percentage of us that actually experience an outbreak. What is an outbreak? A sore? A bump? Is your partner going to die? Is your partner's health um, in jeopardy? What does herpes do that make you feel like you are a risk? It's literally you may or may not get a sore. You're not a risk to be taken. And just because somebody accepted your status is not enough reason for you to let them in, like on something like having intercourse with you. It's not. It should be an expectation. You are the blessing. You are the flex. Okay? Now that we covered that, 